Hello, Anglophone South School teachers. This is Steve. Uh, I'm just following up on my Flipgrid tutorial to do a shorter video that just shows you how to upload and share videos. So maybe you have previously recorded videos you want to share. You can use Flipgrid to do that. If they are under 10 minutes, um, you get into your dashboard here. So you log in with the instructions for my previous video. You click your little icon just to make sure you have logged in properly and you have this full list of items and then I'm going to go to my profile and then hit P plus sign with the video to add a new video. This will start the Flipgrid process of recording a video. My web camera is going to turn on, uh, but I'm not going to use this process and I'm not going to build my video in Flipgrid. I have already recorded a video, so I'm going to click on the options button to the left of the record button. I'm going to choose to upload a clip and this will be a window where I can either drag and drop or browse and find my previously recorded video. So maybe you did a video on PowerPoint or maybe you've uh, made a video on your iPad and you want to upload it to share. I'm going to find my video which is less than 10 minutes. Actually it's about 9 minutes and 59 seconds as I look for it on my uh, very messy desktop. I'm going to click open. Uh, this will start playing right away. It's already kind of in the um, viewer. I'll get a preview of what it looks like. If for whatever reason you need to shorten it or edit it, you can do that by clicking on the timeline. I'm going to leave it the way it is. It's good to go. I'm just going to hit next. Uh, I can change the cover photo, so maybe uh, it's going to pick some part on my timeline. I, I, this is just a thumbnail preview. I, if you want something different, you can take a new picture. You can do lots of things. But I'm going to add a, a title for my video. I'll just call it Flipgrid Tutorial. And a link would be something you would use if you were sharing other uh, links to other things. I don't need to do that, so I'm just going to go save to my profile. Uh, this is a longer video, so it might take uh, a bit of time to upload, and I'll probably edit this so it's shorter, um, but I'll just wait until it's done uploading. Okay, my video is just about done uploading. I, I chose to kind of push to the max of how long I could make my video, so it took a little while. I was important. I didn't close the window. I just was patient, let it uh, show up there, and now it's ready to share. So if I want to share a link to this video, I just can click create link. Uh, and I could share this video in lots of different ways. There's a QR code, but I'm just going to copy the link. Uh, then I can email that out to parents and students, post it on my team site, and when they go to the link, they just see a video player and my video, which is nine minutes and 59 seconds. So it is less than less than 10 minutes. So you can upload to Flipgrid videos less than 10 minutes, share them right in Flipgrid, and send them out to your families and students. Have a great day.